I'm thinking I'm going to show you guys how to get started on hemp bracelets. I like buying jewelry and stuff, but making it, it's unique. Plus, you have more pride in it. When they ask you that's a cool bracelet, you say, yeah, I made it. Makes you feel good. So, I'm going to tell you guys how to get basically started on everything. And it all started with this retro wear. So, we're going to need our hemp. Now, it depends. This is colored hemp. All natural. I like the black the best. Just in case you didn't notice. The red. I'm not crazy about red. Don't like the color red. Sorry. Sorry. But, hemp. Let me get it. Got the hemp. Got scissors. Let's get started. First, how to cut hemp. Measure around your wrist. Leave about three, four inches, just in case you mess up or you want it longer. Whatever reason. So have it measured. How long? This how long? Alright. Then you gotta do it. Measure another length of it. Cut. Now, get, I usually get four times the length. So you're gonna measure one, two, three, and four. Okay, stop there. Double it. So here's the finger with the four, right there. Double it. Cut. I love these scissors. All right, you got that. Now, people have different methods of how to form the end. They have little clasps you can put on, so if you do a clasp at the end, like a little metal clasp, you can clasp it to the other metal, to the other end of your bracelet. But I don't like that. So, we are going to measure. Make sure the ends are the same. It's very important. Then, just tie a knot. Make sure that the knot loop is not too small and not too big. So look at this knot and if this knot can go through here then you're set. There we go. First one. We are going to start doing the straight braid. It's not going to be twisty like those other ones. Take it. Loop. Bring it through. Behind it. Pull it through the loop and tie it. Do the same thing. Bring it up front, loop it through the back, and pull. Front. Loop it through the back and through the loop. Other side. Front. Loop it through the back. Bring it through and pull. This is what you're going to get. It's going to continue all the way down. Now, if you mess up, don't take your scissors and start chopping it up in anger. Not what it's for. Natural hemp. Undo it. This is very forgiving. You don't have to get upset about this. I've done it plenty of times. But practice makes perfect. You know how that saying goes. So. I'll show you guys some examples. We have brown beets. Beautiful. This is white beets. This, ladies and gentlemen, is my ankle bracelet. I love ankle bracelets. So if you make your bracelet and it's too big, try it on your ankle. It might fit. Green beets. Match with the whole entire chair. Beachy. And now we got thick braid. To get a thick braid, 
You don't have to buy thicker hemp. Twelve different strengths. Four, two, a piece. Then you start braiding it. And you got thick. Or you can stay with the thin. Whichever one you like. Okay, you have small beads. Very cute. Very Octobery. Folly. Yeah. Hey, what's up? Yeah. What it do? Yeah. Hey, shorty, I'm trying to get with you. Right. Say she like that. Like that. I'm mad. I'm that mad. type of dude that she can call and she can be with. Uh, not get it popping. Bring it over here. Slowly take my mind off these other chicks. Uh, now that's right. That's right. Now look your lips and go and show me how to mix right. Now what's the deal, ma? Yes, I'm for real, ma. See, that's another story. Just trying to chill, huh? There ain't no looking back to what I had or what she had. Girl, look, be glad.